What's good? It's Chigozi. It's Tuesday, September 18th, 2018. And I'd love to thank Cindy O, a very good friend of ours here in this channel, who's been dropping good knowledge, often leaving really nice comments. In this one, she asks if there could be a decode of the recent announcement from Hawaiian Airlines adding nonstop services to Boston in 2019. And she's asking this because this particular propaganda event popped up in her news feed, which, by the way, is a very good way to see all the propaganda you would like to decode and piece together using your phone. This announcement was released yesterday, September 14th, the same time the gas leak in Massachusetts occurred. So that gas leak occurred on first was occurring on the 13th, 13 slash nine, like Freemasonry. But then, of course, then they have all the news coming out about it, all the propaganda, the follow up coming out the next day to also make it work in tandem with all the other propaganda. So she links me the biz journals. She knows there's a connection between the gas leak and the and this. And of course, there is. And this is because this is the this is perfect, like. She looks at her news feed, sees two pieces of propaganda, and immediately sees the connection and knows that there's a big web going on. It's perfect. That's exactly how you're supposed to see this. And she's not assuming. I mean, that's exactly what it is. So we're going to look at the propaganda, see how it's all synced up. Also synced up with the Boston Marathon bombing. And just think about it. We have an explosion in Boston with the, with, you know, Columbia gas, putting it on by the numbers, Columbia gas are the Freemasons. I mean, Columbia gas, just think about it. District of Columbia, you have Columbus, Georgia, Columbus, Ohio, Columbus, Indiana, all named after that Jewish banker tyrant. So think about it. running a marathon. Now we have nonstop service to Boston and tribute to the marathon. There's no coincidence. Also, the Hawaiian actor, Obama, president at the time of the Boston Marathon bombing, Hawaiian Airlines, sums to 90, like Marathon. If you're at 90, you get 33. And this is happening in the land of the 33. Massachusetts equals 33. Hawaii equals 33. There are only three states that sum to 33. And this is how you remember. If you're at 33, if you can spell it correctly, first off, if you write it, if you write out 33, you get 156. So the first state, the 50th state, because this is 156. So the first state, the 50th state, and the sixth state all sum to 33. Delaware is the first state. The 50th state is Hawaii. We're talking about Hawaiian Airlines, and the sixth state is Massachusetts. We're talking about Massachusetts, Boston, and such propaganda. Delaware, 33, Hawaii, 33, and there's four reductions. So H is the eighth letter, A is the first, W is the 23rd, 2 plus 3 is 5. And then Massachusetts. Massachusetts sums to 33, all in the same cipher. So we're talking about from Hawaii to Massachusetts. That's another connection already inside this property. In. So here... Chad Slattery. I just wonder what the photographer of this piece of propaganda is named sums to. Freemason 96 in the last name. Chad 16, like pi, pi 16, 29, time 20. Very well a time ritual from the federal government. Slattery also has Saturn numbers, Saturn 30, 21, the reflection of 12, because 120, you drop to zero, it's just 12, 69, moon 51. Bavarian Illuminati 188, time 20, as I said, 71, the 20th prime number in his name. And I'm saying this because we have an airplane flying over the sky, you know, sacrifice 46. So here's just the notes I took down on this. 
It's a nonstop flight they're offering to Boston starting 2019. On, on April 4th, 2019, Hawaiian Airlines is going to start offering nonstop flights to Boston. That is the entire premise of this propaganda. Notice how they mention 50 aircraft. Again, Hawaii, the 50th state. So nonstop, some see 32. Boston, some see 32. This is when you reverse the alphabetical order and reduce each letter to a single digit. Massachusetts, it used to be the province of Massachusetts Bay before statehood, admitted to the Union February 6, 1788. That's a date with a what? With 32 numerology, life lesson number 32, and also 23 numerology reflection. So 32 is a central number to Massachusetts as well. Scottish equals 32. There are 33 degrees of Scottish right Freemasonry. 33 degrees. So Eversource is who came in to clean up the event, to fix the explosion that went on at Eversource Energy. Another Masonic company, just like Columbia Gas. Just like you have Walmart and Target, you have Eversource, Columbia Gas, and they love to participate in propaganda. Eversource 131, that's the 32nd prime number. For those new, prime numbers are very important to this gang of Masonic Zionist Jews. Prime numbers represent just being strong, very strong numbers because you're indivisible only by yourself and one. So you, only you are your downfall. Likewise, this gang of Freemasons, their downfall is using this system because it's so easy to expose. So Boston equals 22 in that full reduction from the September 14th date where the Hawaiian Airlines is releasing their propaganda and they're releasing more propaganda about the gas explosions. From then until the date they're going to start their Boston nonstop flights is 202 days. You see this? 202 is just like 22, the master builder number. Boston equals 22. Hawaiian Airlines doing this from then. Also, it's on 4 slash 4, kill 44, time 144. If you write out 44, you get 144. It's so counting the end date, it's exactly 29 weeks. You can also say from the date the gas explosions happened until the, the day Boston has the nonstop flight from Hawaii is 29 weeks. It's exactly 29 weeks from the day it happened. Gas leak equals 29 for the 13th event, 29 weeks. Gas leak 29, just, just the word leak equals 29. Football equals 29. Eversource 131, like Super Bowl. I'm going to link Zachary K. Hubbard's video in the description. And of course, any other videos and information I find about this. And he does definitely show how this connects to the World Series, the upcoming 114th World Series, the Super Bowl as well. Explosion 114, 114th World Series. Just watch this video to learn more. Because this, the Boston Marathon bombing, they're synced to button number 114. But I just want to focus on Hawaiian Airlines because that's the specific question. And it's very good information. And I say it all the time. It's always these minor sounding events, you know? Just a nonstop flight to Boston. That's not, you know, it's not like some Al-Qaeda attack. It's not some Trump Propaganda is nothing spectacular, but those are my favorite pieces to look at because they always have these strong patterns. So thanks again, Cindy, for, for this information. So here's part two of this decode. Really, it's all the same. The new five-day-a-week service will launch on April 4th and be serviced by Hawaiian's Airbus A330 aircraft. So you see this right now. You already see the 33, you're just thinking, damn. And this, Cindy probably saw this, she's like, yeah, 33. Immediately knew it was false flag propaganda. False flag 33, Masonry 33, Massachusetts 33, Hawaii 33, Boston Marathon bombing, reversing the alphabetical order, 330. And now they're using this Airbus A330 aircraft as part of this tribute ritual. This is disgusting. 
using the phone game atria, so just like a, you have your keypad, one has no letters, and then two has A, B, C, three is D, E, F. So you just mash in Hawaiian on the keypad, and all those numbers, you sum, it sums to 33. So on the side of their plane, that Mr. Chad Slattery, this time actor, if this guy even exists, Hawaiian, playing 33 right there. Hawaiian also sums to, well, Hawaii sums to 51, like federal, and we'll see that in a second. So space equals 44. I'm just pointing this out for, again, the like 4 slash 4 release date. And I noticed even something super more central to this, but these are the general reasons I love 44, especially for this particular ritual. So last year, the market between Boston's Logan International and Honolulu's Daniel K. Inouye International Airports, he was murdered by the numbers. We can see, at the end, if we have time, we can match him to this if we can. Blood Sacrifice 76, interesting they're mentioning him with this. But they're saying that the air airports generated about $76 million in ticket sales, according to Hawaii, adding that nearly 500 people are flying between Eastern New England and the islands on any given day. Now, again, I can't help but notice all the fives are pointing out. They're saying earlier, you know, five day a week. We saw the 50 in that picture. Hawaii is the 50th state. They're mentioning 500 here. If you're out of five, you get 42, like Saturn, like Freemason. You know, again, New England. I was talking about how this football related. We know the Patriots are going to the Super Bowl. And here they're talking about New England. Guys, the Boston Patriots, the New England Patriots, the same thing. You might as well call them the Boston Patriots. So the $76 million ticket sales nonstop equals 76. So you see how they put that number right here? Nonstop using the alphabetical order sums to 113. 617 is the 113th prime number. So look at this. Hawaiian is offering special round trip fares of $617 in the main cabin. And I think about it, we're talking about Boston, Massachusetts, you know, one of the original 13 colonies, one of the original pieces of land in this tyrannical bullshit nation with their birthday in 1776. So you see how they're pairing, you know, one of the, the states of some of the 33, we have Massachusetts, Hawaii, 1776. You know, one of the OG American territories. I mean, how, I mean, and Cindy pointed this out in her comments, too. I mean, anyone could see this and be like, yes, this is coded by the numbers propaganda. With almost 5,100 miles, you know, Hawaii 51, the new route between Honolulu and Boston will become the longest regularly scheduled domestic route in U.S. history. And this time ritual doing this type of thing. They're making history with this propaganda event. I didn't even... So I saw the 51 and just, you know, copied this, <laughs> pasted it in, did the Hawaii. I didn't read the sentence, but that's why it's good to read the propaganda. So you can see the type of rituals they're doing. You can see the significance of what they're doing. So just, yeah, for those new Hawaii and federal overlap so much in Gematria, because Hawaii is the federal government. And I'm saying this because, again, I don't assume that all of my viewers are from America. They understand the states of America. If you've ever, ever heard of Hawaii... It is a stolen territory. It used to be called the Territory of Hawaii. It was stolen by this Jewish Zionist cabal. Stolen by the federal government. And look, you go to Hawaii's page on Wikipedia, they literally have a section. <laughs> it's comical, but it says federal government and it has four of their actors right here. Four deceivers. Look at what leads it. This Jewish Zionist, this false Jew from Revelation. This is, by definition, a Zionist Jew. Shats, because he shat all over the territory with his bullshit propaganda and acting, is Jewish. J Street Pop, J Street, shares commitment with Jewish, which supported him, called him a strong voice for the pro-Israel, pro-peace movement, and a supporter of the Iran nuclear agreement. So this tells you right here, he's a pro-Israeli, Zionist Jew. He's a Zionist Jew. If you're pro-Israel, you're Zionist. 
And we have, of course, obviously the two Japanese actors here. And then we have this Samoan actor here. It cannot be any more perfect. A, you know, some Jewish actor leading the three Asians, two Japanese, one Samoan. It's just Hawaii right here. It's Hawaii in a nutshell. You know, the original people over here, this woman, Japanese kind of come over way, way before these designers do tyrants did. And then now we have this tyrant here. 115th Congress by Sonic 115. So I hope this was a decent decode. Just the word gas alone. Sums to 54, 27, 18, and 9, like sun. And I've already taught this. That's why BP what this has the sun logo. I just don't get how people don't see that. And they still say, like, uh, it's all coincidence. BP's logo is the sun. I had a video. I don't know if it's still on this channel. If it's not, I'll either remake it. Because it's really easy to remake. It's how the BP oil spill was put on by the Jesuit order. I think it is on this channel. But you can just see their, their logo is the sun. BP's logo is the sun. Sun. Some of the same numbers as gas. But you're like, oh, but they're oil. They're not just gas. They turn oil into gas. Well, if you're a smart aleck and you're saying that type of bullshit, oil also fits the pattern. 18, 45 to reflection of 54, sun equals 36 as well in the ALW Kabbalah cipher. You know, not hard to see who's putting this on. Not hard to see that, you know, knee source who owns Columbia Gas is just the federal government. I mean, look at their logo. The sun right up there. It's a sun worshiping gang. Columbia, Columbia Gas, some to 49. Knee source, some to 49. Explosion, there's not some to 49. But the plural does. Explosions 49. But explosion, reversing, reducing, sums to 42. I'm glad this is the time for me to talk about this. I remember seeing this piece of propaganda on Wikipedia and CNN. But right when I saw it and before I clicked it, I'm like, this guy's gonna have a 42 in him. So I knew explosion sum to 42. They love quoting the number 42. You know, Saturn 511, 42, 511 the Jewish Gematria. Look how old this guy died. He died in an explosion. You know, bombing. They even use the word explosion. Look how old he died. 42. He died at 42 years old from an explosion. Explosion sums to 42. So you see how you can even guess the details of the propaganda before you even click on it. Just by the theme. That's how you can tell this is all body numbers propaganda. Because if you are any have any sort of sanity in your brain, after making so many of these, I guess, predictions... These many, many predictions, like M-I-N-I -I predictions, over and over and over and over and over again, it becomes clear that you're not some god or anything. It's just obviously a pattern you're understanding. That's when anyone comes and denies this shit. I'm like, how retarded can you be? I'm sitting here all the time, you know, doing the exercises, going through the information. So thank you again, Cindy. A couple more things she did point out that I want to talk about. The CEO is Peter R. Ingram. Can't find the birthday in just a month and a year. And they, they do do that a lot. But it's fine. We have plenty of information. You know, he's 52 right now. Hawaii Airlines began, began in January 30th, 1929. Again, Leak 29, Gas Leak 29, Masonic 29. They have a fleet of 65. 10th largest commercial airline. The airline is known as the flag carrier. The flag carrier 131. See, 131, just like Eversource, who's participating in this propaganda. This is for the Super Bowl foreshadowing. Again, we're talking about Boston. This is for the word 57. 57 is the championship number. 57, 131. Peter R. Ingram. You know, 18th triangular number, double 63. These connect to, well, Peter R. Ingram. This is what I'm going to say, it's sun numbers, you know? Put the R in, you get 18. Take out the R, you get the 18th triangular number. 
and they're linking his company up with this oil gas explosion. You see, those both 18. Well, you know, natural gas, but again, oil, gas, they like to parallel those things. Similar substances in terms of origin. Peter R. Ingram, 144, again, a 4 slash 4. If you're up 44, you get 144. Time, 144. And again, on 4 slash 4, they're going to commence the flights. Sunset, Sun 27. If we're up 45, you get 1, 2, 6. <laughs> you know, first class seats going for 1776. Yeah, it's definitely LOL worthy because it's all a joke from the federal government. Always, you know, mocking people. That's why, why guys, why do you think I laugh at this channel all the time? This shit is a joke. Service begins April 2019. And then the last part, she has an in-flight magazine from Hawaiian Airlines. Hanaho is the name of their magazine. So let's see the name of Hawaiian Airlines' propaganda. That's all this. Hanahu is just propaganda from Hawaiian Airlines. And it's all coded by the numbers. HH, -H, you know, program, 88, HH, -H, poison, 88. Again, if I can spell correctly, 88 connecting to time. Hanaho 32. Again, Bob, Massachusetts founded it with a life lesson number 32. Speaking of which, so again, Massachusetts sums to 33. Hawaii sums to 33. September 13th is a date with a life lesson number of 33. That's why you have those two states participating in this propaganda or at least participating for that propaganda event. One, two, one, like blood sacrifice, 11 times 11 is one, two, one, Revelation, one, two, one. Knee Source Inc., their full name. Sorry for jumping around, but you know, 58, like Freemasonry. Try to keep some information up as we keep the code in this, but we're almost done. I just wanted you to see what this propaganda looks like. Oh, issue 21.3, interesting. The one dated April, May 2018, cover stories about Lawrence Rockefeller and his influence in Hawaii, and especially the Mauna Kea Resort on the Big Island. The magazine came out in April. Kilauea volcano erupted a month later on May 3rd, then took the so called 6.98 earthquake on May 4th. Before the eruption, we had flooding on Kauai Island, North Shore, on April 15th. Over 50% of rain supposedly fell within 24 hours. This sounds like a science experiment from the federal government. That's exactly what she's describing. And she understands this too. Kind of remind me of Hurricane Iniki back on September 11th, 1992. You know, a 119 event. So turning numbers was some big hurricane. You know, we've seen that a lot. You know, Sun 54, May 5th, May 4th. I survived and lived on Kauai back then. Very glad you survived. And lived to tell the tale of this government tyranny. And here, I'm going to read this again because this is important and this requires more research and this is a really good clue. And I know a lot of people like to look further than this. So when it rained 50 inches of rain in 24 hours on Kauai Island, Hurricane Iniki back on, in 92, when they were filming Jurassic Park, now there's another Jurassic Park movie that released this year, The Lost Kingdom. So we have another Jurassic Park movie. They're flooding the Carolinas now. So you can look at all the other Jurassic Park movies and see which natural disasters came out around them. But yeah, thank you so much for sharing this because I'm pretty sure a lot of people are interested in these tidbits of information too. So Hawaii has 666 Gematria. 
This is assumption 111 reversing the alphabetical order. So in reverse Sumerian, it's 666, a prophetic number with this type of science experiment going on. So I wish there's, this was a back, is this a current issue? Because I kind of want to see the back issues and see what she was talking about, but that might just have to be, oh, here we go. The April, May issue, issue 212, volume 21, number two. Look, Rockefeller's Hawaii, developer, environmentalist, and patron of the arts, Lawrence Rockefeller. Why, why not just call him a Masonic Zionist Jew? That would have taken a lot less space. Pursued a progressive vision for Hawaii's tour tourism while striving to protect its natural and cultural heritage. Do you see this? This already tells you the tyranny. What is he doing pursuing a progressive vision for a place that's not his? And it's tourism. I mean, this is what I'm saying about these people are tyrants. You, all you got to do is look up Hawaii. And it's funny, they don't tell you this in school. If your teacher talks about this in school, they'll be fired. You can see how, how Hawaii is a tyrannized place. It was taken. Then what? Eisenhower, one of the presidents, say that they're going to use it for the salvation of the white people, like land for them or something. Like a president literally came out and said this. So they literally said they're going to steal Hawaii for their own agenda. And we know it's the territory of Hawaii. It's not from these people. Look, the like British flag with the Masonic colors also. It's pretty much the American flag with some blue in there and the British flag. Or I guess you could say the French flag. I mean, it's, this, it's the Freemasons. That's what I'm trying to say. The Freemasons putting their flag right there. The territory of Hawaii. You know, it has a rich history, a rich culture. Look at this. And I mean, before even this, like before whatever bullshit this was, I mean, you know, Hawaii before it was colonized. So you see how it was taken, you know, crafted propaganda about it. And then now we see what this tyrant talking about his vision and shit. I mean, it's clear this guy is a banker tyrant putting out a bunch of propaganda. Rockefeller's Hawaii. What does that even sum to? Probably just the numbers of Freemasonry. Probably them printing their propaganda. Oh, no. More sun numbers. You see this shit? Hawaii does. So this is how we learn. Just like how I've exposed how the state of Ohio loves participating in sun rituals. Here we have the state of Hawaii participating in sun rituals. Sun 18, 9, 18, 36 in ALW Kawa, as I just already shown. Oil, gas, all these numbers. Now we have this. Rockefeller's Hawaii. Lawrence Rockefeller. You know, not many people spoke Lawrence like that. But this guy's as good as coded. Zionist 112. Symbol 86. New World Order 75. Order 75. 30. See? Order. Lawrence. That's why it's spelled like this. Because he is a New World Order actor for the federal government. Federal 51. He wrote 33, got 141. See, see the art inside this propaganda? Federal 5133. So they do 51141. And then they do 7530. Like order. This is a Masonic order, and they're telling you that inside their propaganda. This is an embodiment of propaganda. And they're putting out propaganda about him. All he did was act and participate in Masonic propaganda. And 1910, oh, 1910, how convenient we're talking about this gang. 191, the 43rd prime. Oh, what sums to 43? Masonic, 43. And I said before, Hanahu is Masonic Propaganda, Masonic Ritual 88, like HH88. Again, this is John D. Rockefeller Jr.'s son we're talking about. There was a 94 up there. Let's keep that in mind. It's another 18, 9, 9, and 18. You've wrote 13, you get 99. But these are sun numbers. 119, Saturn 119, $119 million. See this? Masonic 43, 
$43 a night. It's the same numbers inside all of their propaganda. Rockefeller is an actor for the federal government. You know, 110 story tall buildings, Rockefeller sitting there looking at the trade centers as they're falling with the 187. Huh. Rockefeller equals 61, the 18th prime number. For all the 18s we've been seeing. The headline sums to 18 both ways, forwards and backwards. Rockefeller, 61, to 18th prime. You see how I can just guys, I didn't I did not assume that Hanahu was Masonic coded propaganda. How can I assume it when she says she has an in-flight, she literally says an in-flight magazine. It already tells you from Hawaiian Airlines. That's all you have to see to understand that it is coded propaganda from the federal government. Hawaii, federal, some of the same thing. Hawaiian Airlines participating in this propaganda. For 33 gets 66. Bible, 66 books in length. So... Perfect. Hanuhu, free propaganda you can read. If, if someone's interested in more of this, you know where to go. You know how to Google it. You saw what I did. You can come here, find more Hawaiian, authentic Hawaiian propaganda to be cooked. Auntie Malia, 43, 74, 191, the 43rd prime. Are you kidding me? <laughs> See this shit? Put this in quotes. Rockefeller commissioned Mary Blanchett Solomon, a.k.a. what? A.k.a. a nickname that has the numbers for Masonic in it. See? We, already, we still have this typed in from before. Because it's the same numbers through all the propaganda. And that's what I'm saying. When this happens, you should let this sink in. I type up Masonic. I talk about it. I teach about it. We keep going down the propaganda. And we don't really have to get rid of it. It's the same numbers. You know, and then you get the prime right here. You know, Prophecy 106. So, you know, 1974, Masonic 74. This is a long piece of propaganda. H H8, and then they only sign off, H H 88. So I hope you understand this is coded propaganda. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I didn't waste too much of your time. But I hope this was a comprehensive look. There's a couple 16s. That's what I was scrolling up to. 106 is just 16. You can just see all these numbers laced inside the propaganda. It's the, all you gotta do is write them down, tally them up, and you'll see there's dis disproportionate saturations. Even this right here, I don't know, if, like the shape of this in this picture. This is a 13, a E151. You know, those are the things that get a little bit whatever. But that's why I focus on shit like this: putting 119, All Seeing Eye 119, Star of David 119, Saturn 119. 15, a reflection of 51. Again, Hawaii, 51. Here, they're talking about 33,562. Just a 33, Hawaii, 33, 51. This is Hawaiian propaganda, and it's by the numbers. I hope you get it now. Even wearing this little, the generic Hawaiian necklace thing. I mean, talk about acting. They have this actor come wear the Hawaiian necklace, participating in Hawaiian propaganda. You see, I've never been to Hawaii before. I've never even been to California. I've never been as far as California. So I've never been anywhere near this place. And I'm showing you all this all coded propaganda from the state of Hawaii. Hanahu is propaganda from the state of Hawaii, from the federal government. Cannot stress it enough. Far out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it wasn't too long. Definitely more videos to come. Oh, nice. 33 minutes and some change. Well, I'll take it. Look at this shit. I mean, look at this. Come on. 1874. I mean, come on. 18 and 74. Two numbers I was ranting about this entire time. Rockefeller, 61 to 18 prime. Sun, 18. Oil, 18. Gas, 18. 74, like Masonic. February 12th. That's 122. Freemason, 122. And the Francis Bacon Cipher. I'm so glad I saw this. This is perfect. Freemason 122, you know, the 12th of February. Now we see the date numerology. February 12th, 1874. You know, 106 numerology, Prophecy 106. So we know this is a special number. Oh my God, are you seeing this? The 43rd day of the year. The 43rd. 
third day of the year. Remember, Auntie Molly at 43. Masonic 43. See, you know, I just had to click undo a few times to get back to where we were. This is Masonic propaganda. HH88, you know, poison program, Jewish. Jewish 3488. Jewish Masonic propaganda. Jewish 74, Masonic 74. And again, we're getting this from this. We're getting this from this clear picture. The royal orders. Oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, how can you live in Hawaii and not see the Masonic bullshit going over you? I, uh, for anyone who's living there right now. You know, I, mean, I hope Cindy O is not the only one who sees this right now. Cindy, you might be one of the very few people in Hawaii who you know, the red and blue pills are Freemasonry. One of the few people in Hawaii who just understands this bullshit. You know, 239 to 52nd Prime, Prophecy 52, another 18. I mean, these people are using the same numbers. 113, receive the companion class, Masonic 29, Reflection 92. 113 is the number for Scottish, Scottish 113, Dishonest 113, Green Screen 113, 311 to 64th Prime. Look, another date with. A life lesson number 34. You see, they're using the same date numerology in these events. This is how you do a scientific research. This We're decoding something earlier. It sums to 106. I said, okay, 106. We see a lot of 16s too. Without even explaining more, you know, 16 is a special number. 16, 106 is a special number to the state of Hawaii. You need more research to see. Maybe there's a very prophetic place. Maybe they love stamping the number for prophecy for pi on why? I've been seeing a lot of times pi number or time you know sun numbers anyway. So look, this this date numerology and then this date numerology down here. Hawaiian consul James Dunn, Hawaiian consul to Glasgow received the companion class. 1892. Talking about over I saw something about overthrowing the queen or something. Yeah, probably the queen of Hawaii. You know, more tyranny. So you see it's the same date numerology. I hope I honed that in. And you're not a mistake. And the new date was a date with 58 days remaining, Freemasonry 58. So now we're going to end there. That's really good information to wrap this up with. But now we've all, including, I've, we've all learned something today. I learned a whole lot. Again, thanks to Cindy. Thanks for her example about, again, this is what I'm saying. These are how you can find really good things and these small details. Hawaiian Airlines announcing a nonstop service to Boston. Most people wouldn't even think to read this or decode it or anything because it's just that. But then you see further into the history of Hawaii, how all the states sync up all the propaganda, all the world nations sync up all the propaganda together by the same code, the same numbers. You see this now, Massachusetts. Perfect. So I know I said the word a lot, but... That's because this is perfectly scripted, perfectly crafted propaganda. They use these, you know, standing actors. You'll get this Jewish Zionist here, Brian Schatz, this piece of shit, leading the way, deceiving people with their propaganda. So take care. Man, I hope I wasn't clipping all video. I just saw some red there. But, you know, I guess we'll see. See ya.